Hello, this time we have another top 5 for you, and it's the top 5 of the best waltzes. Welcome to our channel Tango Music Tutorials. If you like this video then please click the like button and you can also subscribe to our channel of course. Thank you. Waltzes are usually very popular at the Milonga. Most tango dancers uh, love waltzes, not all of them, I know, but most dancers do. And when you play a good waltz standard, then it's usually guaranteed that you have a full dance floor. So, we had an idea like, let's do a top 5 of the best tango waltzes. That was a bit ambitious. Uh, it's almost impossible to pick the best 5. So uh, let's say this is the top 5 for now and we will make another video one day with also the best waltzes. Okay, here goes. At number 5 we have Orchestra Tipica Victor, the radio orchestra of RCA Victor. Earlier we did a Tanda of the Week with Tangos by OTV, but they also made uh, quite a few waltzes that are very popular still being played frequently at the Milongas, like Sin Rumbo Fijo with Angel Vargas, uh, Intima with Carlos La Fuente and the lovely Anita, and perhaps their most famous waltz, Temo. Oddly enough, uh, OTV's recording of Temo is the only recording known by one of the Golden Age orchestras. Temo is sung by Mario Corrales, nowadays better known as Mario Pomar, the stage name he got from Carlos Di Sarli when he joined Di Sarli's orchestra in 1951. The music for Temo was written by Mario Luis Rafeji, also known as Aguariguay, and the lyrics are by Attilio Galvez. <laughs> ¿Acaso no me amas ya? Dime que lo haces tan solo por ver si te quiero más. Dilo, ¿no ves que mi alma espera escuchar tu voz? Entre canciones de besos me dices te quiero, mi vida. Temo que ya no me quiera, que ya no me quiera. Y es cruel tortura el pensar que no me amas, que a otro amas. Dime que es fiel tu cariño, dime que es mío, muy mío, que solo me huyen tus ojos por verme sufrir. At number four we have Rodolfo Biaggi, Manos Brujas, who steals the show in his version of Lágrimas y Sonrisas from 1941. The music of this waltz classic was written by Pascual de Gujo. Biaggi and Juan de Rienzo uh, also recorded this waltz uh, back in 1936. That version has Biaggi playing the piano at the background while the violins and the bandoneons shine. In his own version, uh, Biaggi's piano is very much at the center stage. Oh, 
At number three, one of the orchestra's tango critics love to hate, Alfredo De Angelis. But even the critics must confess some of his waltzes are excellent. We did a tanda of the week before with four of his waltzes, uh, Minovia de la Gere, Popre Flor, Amagaldi and Illusion Azul. But in this top five we have Mi Cranito, music by Alfredo de Angelis himself and lyrics by José Rotolo. It's a duet with Carlos Dante and Julio Martel, recorded in 1949. At number two, a tango waltz by the great Anibal Troilo, Romance de Barrio. Music written by uh, Troilo himself and the lyrics are by Ome Romanzi. Romance de Barrio was recorded in 1947 and just listen how the orchestra uh, holds their breath when Florio Ruiz starts to sing and enjoy the Bondonion variation around the two minute mark. <laughs> Lejano de abril, tu oscuro balcón, tu antiguo jardín, más tarde las cartas de pulso febril, mintiendo que no, jurando que sí, romance de barrio, tu amor y mi amor, primero un querer, después un dolor, por culpa que nunca tuvimos, por culpa que debimos sufrir los dos. Despreciándome tal vez sin pensar que lamento al no poderte tener el dolor de no saber olvidar Hoy estarás como nunca 
lejos mí, lejos de tanto llorar. Fue porque sí que el despecho te llegó como a mí, sin pensar que en el rencor de la Dios castigaba con crueldad tu corazón. Fue porque sí que de pronto no supimos pensar que es más fácil renegar y partir que vivir sin olvidar. Retornan vencidas tu voz y mi voz Trayendo al volver con tonos de horror La culpa que nunca tuvimos La culpa que debimos pagar los dos And then we arrive at number one Like I said, it was a bit ambitious to make a waltz top five. Uh, there are so many waltzes and so many orchestras we had to leave out. Like D'Arienzo, Tanturi, Donato, Laurens, Rodriguez. So we will do another top five one day uh, with also the best waltzes. But we do have a number one and it's recorded in 1979. Now, the 1970s aren't exactly the golden age of tango, but Osvaldo Pugliese managed to make the ultimate recording of a waltz classic, Deste el Alma. Deste el Alma was written in 1911 by the then 14-year-old Rosita Melo, who would later become a renowned uh, concert pianist as well as composer and teacher. In 1927, Roberto Ferpo was the first to record it, and many others followed, like uh, Juan D'Arienzo, uh, Francisco Canaro, uh, who recorded it three times, no less, and Ricardo Tanturi, to name just a few. But no one did it quite like Osvaldo Pugliese. His interpretation uh, is very romantic, intimate, and full of joy at the same time. Just close your eyes and let the music take you away. Enjoy.
Thank you.